All right, so. Let's uh, keep going. All right. Where could those possibly be? Didn't want to teleport that time. I wonder how long I would have kept uh, not wearing that, uh, not wielding that um, unicorn horn with uh, if that person hadn't mentioned that thing. Well, I guess we'll never know. Good thing we've got our reflection. Uh, can't eat that, unfortunately. Now let's pick up some of this food. Okay. All right, here we go. First, let's uh, figure out what some of these things are. I uh, hate these giant spiders. Let me just check something quick, yes. Because, not because they're hard, but they're annoying. You know, I've frozen me in place for a while, but they're giant spiders, so who really cares? Oh, wait, um, that's confusion, the bad one. Uh, where, where was it? Um, I remember because the soldier threw it at us, or someone did. Amulet. You know what? We'll go back. Wait, how the freaking... This can't possibly be enchant armor or remove curse. Not at that price. Oh, wait. Oh, of course. We're... Yeah, we're we're a tur... We're... Yeah, our charisma isn't that high and we're a tourist with the markup. That would make sense. Yeah, I can get it now. The reason, incidentally, if you're wondering why I haven't used the, uh, wand of make invisible is I know this probably seems kind of silly but it's actually if you don't have see invisible or extrinsic telepathy you actually can't see yourself you're just this blank space which is kind of annoying to annoying and since we're uh, far and at this point since it doesn't really make a big difference I'm not going to be doing uh, that at the moment However, once we get the intrinsic telepathy, we will be okay. Wow, second ring of conflict. Keystone cops, yeah, they'll normally these guys just pop up when you steal from a store and then keep bugging you. Oh, well, looks like we're gonna have to deal with all those soldiers. Do 
Do I really feel like it right now? Oh yeah, those number things, those are like crates. You can't go through them. There are some prisoners inside of them. It's They're kind of just there for flavor. Holy... Wow. Oh wait, hang on. Let me kill the nymph. Ugh. I really wish I had a ring of free action. That uh protects you from paralysis like that. I mean, why am I taking the spider? I should be killing the spider, uh, the centaur. Screw it. It's time. Did we had a ring of regeneration? Was it cursed? I'm going to put this on to restore health quick. By the way, both of these um, really rip through your nutrition, so I'm going to get hungry really fast. Okay, so I haven't really discussed conflict. Conflict makes everything attack everything, basically. So that means that they will be attacking each other instead of me. They still can attack you, but they'll often be attacking other monsters. The point of this isn't so much to make them kill them, so much as it distracts them. And regeneration restores your health very quickly. Ah, so many soldiers. Oh, yeah, I got hit by that again. Luckily, they weren't able to take advantage of it by, you know, attacking me, because they were busy attacking each other. Oh, yeah, we don't need this uh, regeneration anymore. I'll just put this back on. Now, there's this is a Master of Thieves. There are several ways to deal with him. Now, he doesn't... Now, the Platinum Eudorian Express card, which gives magic resistance, is currently at his feet. He hasn't picked it up yet. That means you can use a Wand of Death. But that seems kind of a waste, honestly. This is what I suggest doing instead. Oh, and by the way, it, what, so what you can do... Uh, here's what I suggest doing instead. Go up to him. By the way, if you're wondering, he's meditating. He doesn't necessarily wake up. Just attack him like this. Wham! Oh, he picked it up. Well, that's a shame. Anyway, but he didn't, um... So here's what you do. You teleport and go up here. Now, even though his attacks are kind of lame, you might want to engrave Elbreth anyway. Oh, wait, he can't do Elbreth. Oh, yeah, he's an at. As symbols never suffer Elbreth. Anyway, he goes blah, 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 this blah, 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 blah. Whatever. Anyway, so he's covetous. He can do this teleporting thing I was talking about earlier with the liches. So what you... You want to do, if you don't want to use the Wand of Death, which I can't do now anyway, because you got the Platinum Enduring Express card, is teleport over to the upstairs, wait for him to come, and then just wail away at him. You shall never be rid of me, I shall go wherever you go, um, and regain what is rightfully mine. Well, um... By the way, some of them say things like this. They say, oh, I will return. Well, they never do. So that's kind of pointless. Wherever. I'm pretty sure wherever should be one word in this case, but I'm not necessarily sure. Anyway, 
He drops a few things. First, the Platinum Endorian Express card and the Silver Bell. You need that Silver Bell to win the game. Alright, Platinum Endorian Express card. Awesome. Now, as uh, this thing... Here, I can even show you... Um, It'll give you a quick description. Drop it, question mark. Uh, more info, yes. See, it says you give ESP, I mentioned that, reduces all, it makes spell damage unto you by half, makes you magic resistance, and can charge other objects when invoked. All of them can do something when invoked. Oh, no, wait, I don't think the Magic Mirror Merlin can do something when invoked, but that's okay. So it's really great because of that ability. And it means we, we won't have to spend a wish on the scroll of charging when we get that, um, that, uh, wand of wishing. Now, in the meantime, I would like to... Oh! Wow, I totally forgot I had that Ring of Conflict on. Let's take that off. Yeah, that's the problem of Ring of Conflict. It'll make the peaceful guys attack you. I'm curious about what some of these things are, so I am going to use that, um, especially this amulet, which might actually be pretty useful. If it's an amulet of life-saving or something. Actually, there aren't that many amulets that are terribly useful for us. Right now, I think it's just magical breathing and life-saving would be the biggest things. All right. Yeah, we might as well use that scroll of identify. Oh, we found another one anyway. Let's see. Let's get all of these. What else do we have that we aren't at least possibly sure about what it is? Oh, wait. So, oh yeah, we got all of this stuff. I wonder if I should sell some of these if we we're not ever really going to use them. Alright. So yeah, we can't get anything else. Let's put away the stuff we do know. I want to leave the key and towel and stuff out this time because, because I'm so bad at remembering these things, I'm afraid I'll forget about uh, bringing them back again. Okay. Oh, we don't need to know both of these. Uh, we can drop one of these because they're the same thing. I do want to know this. Actually, we don't need to know the second one because once we know one, we'll know what the other is and can just name it such. Okay. First, let's get these things out. And that's all it seems we can... We don't need the K rations. Okay, um, wait. Be more useful to know some of this stuff, I think. Alright, let's just try reading this and figure it out. I want to know if this, um, amulet is decent. Oh, wait. Did I leave? I, I left it in there, didn't I? The whole, um... I left the, uh, identify scrolling there. Identified everything, nice. Now we even know what some of these things are, and we know that some of these are useless. I'm just going to skip up, press escape to get through it, because we can just look at them. Amulet of ESP, that is... Actually, we can still polypilot, so let's take it. Okay, we had, um, now let's grab this, because now that we know that this is enchant armor, we know this is remove curse. Spellbook of Dig, now ah, we're never going to need that, I don't think. Don't need Wand of Opening. That's actually a useful spell, though. Once we all uh, actually start learning this stuff, it'll be nice.
Well, I guess we can drop the wands that we, uh, that are at zero and just sell them. Yes. Yes. I don't, I don't even really care enough to, like, you know, make sure he's offering the full possible price. Oh, wait, yeah, we uh, zapped the uh, Wand of Invisibility at ourselves, didn't we? So he won't let us get out? Let me, let me just see. Oh, wait, we haven't paid. That's... That's the problem. We haven't paid. We have to specify who we're paying. All right, so now what we can do is give ourselves the, um, or was it make invisible? Sure. But because we have our intrinsic, uh, let me just make sure there's nothing to pay. Okay. Now we can teleport out and let's teleport in here. Well, we're going to get see all the exciting things that's being sold here next time. I think it's about time that we take a break now. We've got that and the uh, Platinum Yandorian Express card, which is quite nice. So I think we're doing pretty well. We'll examine this and then we will, I believe, uh, uh, go towards the castle. But that'll be in the next section. For now, it's goodbye. As in, not just the end of the video, but the end of this sec of this sort of run of me playing through it. We're going to be saving um, this and uh, leaving. See you later, and next time.